Hi, I'm going to show you how to actually configure a personal password in Team Viewer. So let's say you have a computer whereby you connect um, to that remote computer regularly and you want to configure a personalized password so that you don't use the default password which is being showed here. So let's say, for example, um, I want to connect, I want to be connected to this computer from um, from my office and my computer is at home or you want to be connecting to this computer to a remote location or to a data center so so what you need to do is this <coughs> sorry so you go to extras here under options you have the options to actually set a password for this computer so let's go let's go to security and here in security so we're going to actually configure a password let me just configure a new password for this team viewer And again, mind you, when you try to log on to this computer, so you can see the Windows logon is not allowed. So what you need to do, you need to actually uh, select allowed for administrator only, which means that when you remotely connect to this computer, you should be able to perform administrative tasks on this computer. If not, without you um, selecting this and you try to perform uh, administrative tasks, remotely on this computer, you're going to get a pop-up, which, of course, is going to tell you that um, the connection has been blocked because of your access is not um, uh, um, administrative um, connected. So what you need to do is just to click OK. And there you go. So the password has been configured. So the next time you try to connect to this computer, you know, you're not going to use this password. And mind you, I'm actually um, doing this video, but I can change this password and just create a new random password as well at any time. You can see we have the option to actually, we can set a personalized password, which of course is going to take us to the security options here where we, where we just set a password for this computer. Thank you very much for taking your time to watch this video. My name is Kelvin Johnson and please, if this video has, has been of any help to you, don't forget to give me a thumb up and also subscribe to my YouTube channel for more IT related video. Thank you and see you next time. Bye.